Alright guys, so this is going to explain to you how to use everything on the website, including like how to view it, how to change the viewing, how to upload images, download images, you know, the whole shebang. So we're going to move over to this little icon, which is going to be your internet. Mine happens to be Safari because I'm using a Mac. If you're on a PC, it could be Firefox, or it could be Opera, or it could be any kind of web browser. As long as you get on to the internet, that's how you're going to do it. This is how the website's going to look. There's currently three albums right now, but over time that'll increase. And now the website's name specifically is going to be gallery.mac.com slash ligerxx. Now when you get a chance, you want to bookmark that and save it as a favorite or bookmark it, whatever it's called. And now this guy's going to take it away. He uses his hands a lot, so just ignore it. Web Gallery creates an amazing online photo experience that feels more like a desktop application than a web page. Here's my web gallery. You can see all my photo albums, including the one we just published. Similar to iPhoto, you can skim over these thumbnails to see the photos inside. But this is on the web. And the cool thing is that the browsing experience is the same on a Mac and PC. We can click on the baseball album and see all of its photos. And I can move this slider to adjust the size of my photo thumbnails. By clicking on any photo, we see a beautiful large version. If my friends want these photos on their computer, they can click the download button and get a high resolution image that can be used to create prints up to 16 by 20 inches in size. Web Gallery provides several more viewing options. I can watch an online slideshow of the album. In addition, there's Mosaic, which shows off a large photo along with thumbnails that I can click in any order. I can resize these as well. Carousel is another fun way to see pictures. I can scroll back and forth to flip through my photos or click on any one I want to see. If I ever want to go back to my gallery page, I just click here. Now I can click to look at any other album I've shared. It's easy for friends and family to contribute their photos to my .Mac web gallery, whether they're on a PC or Mac. My friend Derek also took some really great pictures at the game. He's on a PC, but when he visits my web gallery, it looks just like it does on a Mac. He can view my photos or upload his new shots to my gallery. All he has to do is click the Upload button, type in his name, and the security code that protects your gallery from automated spamming. Then Derek uploads the photos he'd like to share, and moments later, they appear alongside the rest of the pictures in my album. iPhoto stays in sync and automatically downloads Derek's photos into my library. So they're not only on the web, they're also on my Mac, where I can edit them, print them, or use them in my next book, card, or calendar. My friends can also contribute photos to a web gallery by email. Clicking on Send to Album shows an email address that's been created specifically for this album. Any photos emailed to this address will get added for everyone to see.